video. In this video, we'll show you how to use the YouTube element in Titan Web. If you want to pull data across Salesforce or just render a video in your Titan Web, and this is the best way to use it if you're using YouTube. So, you go over to Media, scroll bottom left, you have the YouTube element. Now, you can use either static value that you can just copy from any YouTube website, um, or you can just use it dynamically. So you can go to Salesforce, go to Salesforce, and let's say I've got my opportunity here, Salesforce, with the URL here. Let's say I copy this ID, and I say, get my URL from opportunity, where opportunity ID equals static value like this, and in my mapping, the YouTube needs to be the CEO avatar URL. Click apply. And this one, I want it to be on load. Click apply, close, apply again, save. Let's make this a bit bigger. And now if I go to publish this, this is the actual YouTube video that I should pull across. And if I load it, you can see here it is. What is CRM? And you can just go ahead and play this video directly into your website. And it's just like that. It's the same video. All you simply do, you can either pull it from Salesforce directly, or you can just paste it statically on here. And either way, it will work nicely. You can also set conditions if somebody clicks on it, or you know, if it contains like a certain value, you can affect other elements. You can get from sales, or you can even set it up as an animation. So you can have the video coming in. Let me show you like a quick preview of this. So here it is. Let's publish this. And you can see it's just come in with the animation in there now. And then that's about it. This is how you can set your metadata. And that's the uh, YouTube element for you.